Hey, what is going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. This is day eight of our Star Survival Bakara series. So on day seven, we used one of the derived roads, the Cockroach Road with the No Mirror, and we will continue that trend today. I'll be playing the majority six, but I am gonna look at the Big Eye Road instead of the main road. And again, as a reminder, if you don't know how to use the derived roads or play my version of majority six, check the link down in the description below. I will have all of the videos listed ready to go for you to check out. My stop loss is capped at 48 units for the star 2.0. Original unit size, $100. We'll break it down for stage one and use $25 units. Shoe is ready to go. Let's see what the burn card is. A six. Okay. Before we play the majority six on the big eye road, I will take some free hands. And while I'm waiting for my triggers on the majority six, I will play the chop on the big eye road. Okay guys, let's start day number eight. Banker wins. We have to wait until a result shows up on the big eye boy before we can play the chop. Okay, guys? Banker wins. Player wins. Okay, so one more free hand here and then you will see a result appear on the big eye road. Player wins. And our first result is a red circle. Since we're not looking at banker and player, I will write R for red and B for blue. Okay, representing the red circle or blue circle on the big eye boy. Okay, so there we go, R for red. I'm gonna play the chop. Okay guys, so I'm looking for a blue circle here. I'm gonna start my bet off on player. Here we go. And banker wins. Red circle, we lose the 25. Okay. My trigger has showed up for a majority six. You can see that there are two reds in a row. So that is one of my triggers on majority six. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and place a bet on red. All right, so 25 on banker. Player wins. We've got a blue circle instead, minus 25. I have one more opportunity here to bet on majority six. Okay, I'm looking for the red circle once again, so keep it on banker here. Banker does win, first win of the day. We get our red circle, win 25. We can now parlay our bet. And when I hit on majority six, I will go back to the chop, okay guys? So if we're playing the chop, I'm looking for the blue circle this time. So I'm gonna keep my bet on banker here for the blue circle, parlayed bet. Wow, player got us there. Player wins, red circle, we lose the parlay. I'm gonna continue playing the chop as this column comes to an end. Okay, so I'm looking for blue circle once again. I'll bet player this time. Wow, <laughs> banker wins. We got caught the last two times. All right, so that is another red circle, minus 25. Okay. So we've lost four units already. If we go down three more units, 
I'm gonna head over to stage two. Okay, so start of our new column here. I'm gonna continue playing the chop while we wait for our triggers. So looking for a blue circle here, 25 on bank. Unbelievable, we get caught again on the third card. <laughs> Player wins. It's okay, we're gonna stick to our strategy here. Minus 25. This happens at a real casino and you know, it frustrates a lot of people. They think the cards are not going their way. <laughs> All right, still waiting for my trigger. I'll continue playing the chop as red is trending right now, the red circle, but I'm gonna continue betting on the blue circle. 25 on player. Finally, we pick up a win here. Player wins. Blue circle. Plus 25, we get paid. No trigger on majority six. So I'll continue playing the chop, looking for a red here. I'm gonna keep it on player. Natural nine, player wins. Okay, we get a red circle, perfect. And we win our first parlayed bet of the day. So we can stay on stage one for the moment. Okay, uh, still no trigger on the majority six. So I'll go back to the blue circle, 25 on bank. Player wins. It was a red, minus 25. Whoops. There we go. Okay, so we lose that. I have my two in a row trigger for majority six, so I'm gonna play the red circle. 25 on player. Nope, banker wins. Get a blue circle instead. Minus 25. Okay, so we lose that. Majority is still red, so let's place another bet on red. Okay, that's a 5-5 tie. I'm not playing the tie jump, so I will not record ties. Let's keep the bet up, keep going. Player wins. Minus 25. So that column, unfortunately, tied 3-3. Three, three. As you can see, there are three reds and three blues. Hey, it does happen on the majority six. So we lost that column. All right, so let's see here. I'm at minus 125, two more units, and we'll head over to stage two. Let's start our new column, but while we do, we are gonna play the chop, so I'm looking for red here. Red circle. Natural eight, player wins. So not off to a good start right now. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna move this down so you guys can see. There's a blue. There we go. So here we go. We have to win this or we're down seven units and we're gonna go to stage two. All right, so looking for the red circle here. That will be on player. Natural eight, player wins. We do get our red circle. Plus 25, we have to win the parlay. All right, playing the chop. I'll keep my, I'll switch it over actually to bank since I'm looking for the blue circle. Natural nine, player wins. We get a red circle instead. Minus 50 and take a look. We are down seven units early. So I'm going to stage two now and I'm gonna do hundred dollar bets. We have our trigger on red for majority six. So let's place a bet on red player wow one over nothing hey we'll take it player wins we hit on majority six okay hundred dollars we have to win the parlay though so two hundred dollar bet coming up let's go back to the chop since i hit on majority six looking for a blue circle so i'll switch my parlay bet over to banker Okay, it's looking good for us so far. Unbelievable. <laughs> Player wins. 
How many times has that happened? The third card draw, we end up losing by, barely by one or two. Okay, so player does win that. Another red. Okay, minus 200. We have one more opportunity at the $100 level. Okay, still looking for a blue circle. So 100 on bank. We lose again. Player wins. Another red. Minus 100. Okay. We now have to go to the $200 level as we start our new column. All right. I am going to be betting on the blue circle here. Okay, guys. Let me move this down a little bit. So $200 bet now. Okay. So on stage two. I'm looking for the blue circle, so here we go, on banker. Natural eight, we'll take that, banker wins. We finally get a blue circle. Move this down a little bit. Okay. Plus 200. We are not out of the hole just yet, we have to win this parlayed bet. We're gonna continue playing the chop, looking for the red circle, I'll keep it on banker. Parlayed bet, uh-oh, natural nine, player wins, we do not get the red circle. We get another blue, we lose that. Okay, we have one more opportunity at the $200 level. So I got my trigger on majority six, so I will place $200 on the blue circle, player. Perfect, player wins. Get the blue circle, plus 200. Okay. Can we win this parlay? Going back to the chop since I hit on majority six, I'm gonna keep my bet on player here, looking for the red circle. Pretty much even right now, both will draw. Okay, we need a monkey here. No, <laughs> banker wins. Okay, another blue. We lose that, minus 400. Okay. From here on out, we have one opportunity to hit back to back at the $300 level now. Okay, I'm looking for red still, so I'm gonna bet on banker here. $300 on bank. Natural nine, banker wins. We get our red circle, plus 300. Okay, come on, we need to hit this parlay. We need to hit this. Going back to the blue circle, okay? So I'm gonna keep it on banker here for the blue circle. Stack that up, here we go. My God, natural over natural, but we are on the wrong side. Player wins. We get the red circle instead. Minus 600, that was a parlayed bet. Okay, so it's getting scary now at the $400 level. Star 2.0, can it keep us in the game? Okay, start of a new column, playing the chop, looking for blue circle. So I'm gonna bet on a banker here for $400. Natural eight, we'll take it. The first win is great, but we need to hit back to back. That's the key. Okay, so 400, we need to hit this. Let's collect and press. Okay, I'm gonna stack my bet and I'm gonna place it on the red circle here. So I'm gonna move it over to player. Let's see if we can hit. Okay, the odds are in our favor. Banker will draw. Yes, there we go. Player wins. We get our red circle and we hit on our parlayed bet. Take a look. We have recovered and are in profit $125. Perfect. Okay, so that was an $800 win. I'm going to do it like this. I'll take five, six, seven, and then I'll take four greens. 
because we're going back to level one. Actually, I'll take more greens. Take four more. Just like that, guys. Recovered in profit, 125. We can go back to stage one, okay, with $25 bets. I'm gonna clear this. So BR will get moved down. No trigger on majority six, so let's continue playing the chop here, looking for a blue circle. 25 on player, back to stage one. Natural eight, player wins. Plus 25. So you guys saw that we weren't hitting that many times. It was pretty rough for us, but you know, the star 2.0 kept us in the game. All right, we're gonna stack our bet. No trigger for the majority six because it's choppy. So back to the red circle we go. I'll keep it on player here. Oh, natural versus natural. Banker wins. Okay, so that was a blue. We have our trigger on majority six. Gonna place a bet on blue. All right, 25 on player. By the way, you guys have to keep track of our max profit level. It was 125, okay? So if we go down seven units from 125, we would go to stage two again. All right, guys? So here we go. Looking for a blue circle here. Player wins. We do get our blue circle. Okay, plus 25. All right, since I hit on majority six, go back to the chop now, red circle. So I'm gonna move it over to banker. Nope, player wins. Another blue. So we lose the parlay. Start of a new column, red circle. So placing a bet on player. Player wins. We get the red plus 25. Let's stack and place it on blue circle. Gonna move it over to bank. Natural eight. Perfect. We get the blue circle plus 50. All right, new profit level 150. Let's keep track of that. All right, no trigger. I'm gonna keep playing the chop here. All right, so 25 on bank. Player wins. Blue, minus 25. Okay, we got our trigger for majority six, two blues in a row, so I'm gonna place a bet on blue. All right, player. Banker wins. We get a red instead. Okay, minus 25. Column is tied 2-2 on the big eye road. So I'm gonna go back to the chop here, bet on blue. Okay, so on banker. Natural nine for the player, we lose. We get red instead, minus 25. Okay, we have a 3-2 majority now. Second trigger for majority six, so we will place a bet on red here. Okay, banker. 5-5 five, five tie. Two over one, banker wins, we'll take that. So we hit on the majority six as the column came to an end, plus 25. Okay, let me clear this. We're gonna play the chop, so I'm playing blue at the moment. Let's remember that. Okay, looking for blue here. So banker bet, I'm gonna keep my bet up. Let's stack this. Natural eight, perfect, banker wins. We do get a blue and we win our parlay. 
150, that was our max profit level. Let's see if we can get above this. Okay, going back to the red now. Banker wins. No trigger. Back to the blue circle. Switch it over to player. Banker wins. All right, minus 50. I have my trigger for majority six, two reds. So I'm gonna place a bet on red. Seven, seven, tie. Player wins. Minus 25, no majority yet, it's tied 2-2. I'm gonna go back to the chop, Put a place a bet on red. Red circle, okay. Banker wins. Okay, so we lose that. We have a 3-2 trigger for the majority six. I'm gonna place a bet on blue here. So I'm looking for banker. Player wins. Get a red instead, so we lose that column as it tied 3-3. Okay. So if we go down to minus $25 on our Excel sheet, that means we lost seven units and we'll head over to stage two. Okay guys, so start of a new column. We're playing the chop, looking for blue. So on to player. Banker wins. Wow, this one's really making us work, huh? <laughs> Okay, so we lose that. If we lose two more units, on to stage two. Playing the chop still, blue circle, I'm looking for banker here. Natural nine, bank wins. Okay, blue plus 25. Gonna parlay the bet now. No trigger, looking for red. Keep it on bank. Banker wins, perfect, plus 50, all right, still no trigger, I'm going to continue playing the chop, all right, looking for blue, so I'm going to put 25 on player, natural 8, player wins, we get our blue, Plus 25, let's collect and press. Still no trigger on majority six. So I'll continue playing the chop here. I'll leave it on player. Natural nine, banker wins. Okay, we lose the parlay. And we have a three, two trigger on majority six. I'm gonna place it on the blue circle here. So I'm looking for banker. Natural eight, banker wins. We do get the blue circle, plus 25. Okay, so we hit on majority six there. I'm gonna go back to the chop, so I'm playing red. Gotta remember that as I clear this. All right, so playing red now. I'll keep it on bank. Nope, natural nine for the player. Blue wins, we lose that. Okay. Back on player we go. Seven, seven tie. Natural eight, player wins. Red, plus 25. Okay. Gonna play the blue circle, I'll keep it on player here. Seven, 
666 tie. Player wins, we win the parlay. No trigger on majority six. I'll continue playing the chop on the big eye road. Okay, so looking for red here, going back to $25. Let's keep it on player. 2-2 two, two tie. Wow, a lot of ties lately. Seven over six, banker wins. We have a trigger on majority six as we lose that. All right, looking for a blue circle here. So I'm gonna go on player, majority six bet. <laughs> Another tie, zero, zero. Wow, unbelievable. Yet another tie. Player wins. Okay, we hit on majority six. Plus 25. All right, let's go back to the chop now. Okay, so I'm looking for the red circle. I'll move it over to bank. 6-6 six, six tie, wow, my goodness, the amount of ties. No, <laughs> you can't make this up. That's two back-to-back -back ties in the shoe alone. Okay, we almost had another one. Player wins. All right, so minus 50. Start of a new column. This shoe is giving us some trouble, huh? <laughs> We're still up $75. So start of a new column. Let's bet on the red circle here. So on player. Natural nine. Player wins. We hit on red, plus 25. Let's pick up that win. Okay, so going back to blue here, move it over to bank, parlay bet. Banker wins. Okay, we hit the chop, plus 50, no trigger. We get paid here. So back to our max profit of 150, we can't get above that. Let's see if we can uh, do that now the shoe is almost coming to an end I might have to reshuffle for the first time during the star survival we've never played more than one shoe so far okay <laughs> so this is getting interesting going back to the red circle so my bet will be on banker here nope natural eight player wins that's blue we get our trigger for majority six but we lose that bet so I'm looking for blue here Bet will be on player. Player wins. We hit on majority six again. Back to the chop as I parlay my bet. I'll keep it on player. Banker wins. We lose the parlay. Okay, still looking for red here. Natural eight, player wins. Get another blue, minus 25. All right, I'm gonna move this down. Remember we have to bet red for the chop as I clear this. Okay, so looking for red, bank or bet. Banker wins. Finally get a red here. I know we're going back and forth on stage one. So stay with me, guys. Stay with me. So I'm going to 
Bet on blue circle here. Let's keep it on banker. Wow, one over nothing. Player wins. Another red, we get a trigger for majority six, minus 50. Let's place a bet on red now. Okay. Wow. Player wins. We get a blue instead. We could bet on red once again for majority six. Okay, so I'll place a bet on player here. Natural nine, player wins. Okay, so we do get a red. We hit on majority six, plus 25. Back to the chop, looking for blue. Move it over to banker here. Natural eight, player wins. Wow, this shoe giving us a hard time. <laughs> Even though we are flip-flopping back and forth between uh, stage one, but we are at neutral right now. If we lose one more unit, that would be minus seven. So I'm gonna head over to stage two, okay guys? Because we're keeping track of our max profit level. All right, so let's see here. Okay, we're going to play the chop still. So a blue circle, I'm gonna bet on banker. We have to win this, okay? So we do pick up a win here. Banker wins. Blue. Start of a new column. I'll continue playing the chop. I'll leave it on bank. And there's the cut card. This is the last hand. Player wins. We lose that bet. Okay, that was a blue. And take a look. We are down seven units from our max profit level. So I have to go to stage two as we reshuffle and go to a, another table, <laughs> okay? Because this is the first time we're playing two shoes. It's giving us a hard time, all right, guys? So let me go ahead and reshuffle right now. Okay, the new shoe is ready to go. Let's see what the burn card is. A nine. Okay. Okay, I've cleared everything. We are down minus $25. So I'm gonna start off on stage two, okay? Once we get our first result on the Big Eye Road. All right, guys, so today it's been a longer session. Day seven, nice and quick. Today, <laughs> it's giving us a hard time. That's how it goes in real life. All right, so let's take some free hands here. Player wins. Banker wins. Banker wins. First result is up on the big eye road. It is a blue circle, so I'm gonna start playing the chop. All right, so my first bet will be on banker, stage two. Wow, natural versus natural, we are on the right side. Banker wins, we get a red circle, okay. Plus 100, we have to win the parlay here. Parlay will be on the blue circle since there is no trigger for majority six. So here we go on player. Pretty even right now, both will draw. Looking good for us. There we go. <laughs> Great start to the shoe. Player wins, we hit back to back. And take a look, we are at 275. We recovered. 
and are in profit. So only $25 away from our win range goal. The first shoot was brutal. It just, you know, back and forth, but we hit on our first try on stage two, going back to back. All right, this was a blue. So we can go back to stage one here. No trigger on majority six. Let's continue playing the chop. Looking for a red circle here. So I will bet on player back on stage one. Looking good for us. Nope, <laughs> eight, eight tie on day number eight. Had to happen. Let's see if we can hit this. Wow, we caught a break there. Two over one, player wins. So we get a red, plus 25. And my goodness, take a look, $300 after a long session. We are right at our win range goal. So you know what? We are finally gonna stop and lock in a three unit profit on day number eight. Day number eight in the books, a tougher session today. We had to grind it out. It took us two shoes for the first time during this series, but it doesn't matter. We stuck to our game plan. And for the second shoe, it only took us three bets for us to get to our win range goal. I know this has been a long video, but if you are still with me, you are the real champ, <laughs> okay? Go ahead and smash the like button, subscribe to my channel, turn on bell notifications, check out my website. That is it, I am heading out. I will catch you guys on day number nine. Ciao.